because we have an interesting setup going on right now. I didn't feel like pulling out my tripod for some reason. I don't know why I'm being lazy. This is how it looks. <laughs> Anyways, good morning, you guys. Happy exam week. I'm starting this vlog on a Wednesday. I know wh why am I starting a week in my life on a Wednesday. I was just not feeling like vlogging yesterday. On Monday, I didn't plan on vlogging, so... Here I am today starting a vlog on a Wednesday. I have my chlorophyll water here. Also, I'm breaking out, so let's disregard the pimple patch and like the huge scar on my face. I don't know why people say chlorophyll water tastes like anything because mine looks like this and I don't taste anything. Mine has no flavoring in it and a lot of people get it flavored because they think it tastes bad, but honest to God, guys, it tastes like water. Add some ice cubes. I put a little bit of a spoon in it. Really good. I'm gonna take a ginger shot. We got this one here I got from the grocery store yesterday. I bought two to try it out. I do not know why this isn't focusing. This is a brand if you're interested. Have I ever taken a ginger shot before? No, but we're gonna we're gonna try this out. I guess I'll just do it right now while we're here. I'm scared. If it's good, I'm going to purchase more. I'm a little worried though because it is bright yellow. It has turmeric in it and if you watch any of my braces videos, you know that turmeric is a no-no for clear braces. So... We're gonna, we'll see how this goes. I've, I'm, I'm scared I've never taken a ginger shot, so I'm gonna have my water here. It says shoot or dilute. Okay, cheers. Oh, I couldn't even take the full shot. Ugh. Ugh, that's gross. So I'm about to make my to-do list. I do this every single day and plan out my day. I was not productive. I was super productive Monday. I don't know if it's the weather. It decided to snow in almost like May. It's literally almost May and we have a full snow moment going on there. So I don't know if I'm just unmotivated from that. I had a late start to my day as well. It's literally 10.35. Monday I woke up at 6 a.m. I'm gonna make a to-do list. I'm gonna stop talking. Let's get started with our day. I'll let you know what I'm gonna do. for today is to be super productive and get everything on my to-do list done even though I woke up late. I'm hoping that although I woke up at a pretty late time for me, I can still be as productive as possible. I don't have a ton of things to do, but I do have a lot of studying and an assignment to do. Well, not an assignment, an exam, but it's like an assignment exam. I don't know how to explain it. I'm going to do some emailing right now, do some planning, all that kind of stuff, and then I'm going to work out and either get ready and study or study and then get ready and then study some more. You'll see, but that's my little overview of the day. It's kind of boring today, but we're gonna make the most out of it. Basically, we're gonna have a productive day and if I manage to get everything done, I'm gonna reward myself by watching Netflix tonight or Disney Plus, because I have shows that I'm very behind on. <laughs> did not go well. I basically kind of stopped halfway through. I did some ab work which was really good and I was supposed to do arms and legs like arms and like quads or something to combine two days so I missed yesterday. I just kept getting distracted. I was dealing with something on my phone and I have to my friend is actually coming right now to get me because I'm helping her with her school project like I have to take a picture of her at a park. I kind of just ran out of time so basically my workout was a fail i decided that at the end of the day once i'm done all my work once i have no distractions i'm going to do a workout just pretend this will never happen just because i basically only did abs i guess i just haven't been motivated to work out but i want to work out i'm gonna go help my friend and go to the store i'm gonna take you guys with me we're gonna go take pictures for a school project now we just drove by I'm so trying to figure out parking. Hi guys, I'm home from the grocery store. I'm going to show you what I got. Okay, hi guys. 
I'm home now. I am having a late lunch that took way longer than I thought, but I'm having a bacon and egg gouda sandwich and orange juice. I figured out how to make it myself, so hopefully this tastes good. So there's no bacon in it, but it's like the dupe of the Starbucks one. I even made the egg fluffy, and I've never done that. So hopefully this tastes good, but I'm gonna eat. I normally don't eat in my room, but I'm in a rush. So yeah, I'm just gonna get my shiz together and study. So you'll see me when I'm studying. <laughs> finally at my desk studying. It is 5.03 p.m. I'm gonna be completely honest. I just started studying now. I really want to blame this on the fact that I woke up late, but it's definitely not, that's not the issue. The issue is that I just need to be more serious when it comes to schoolwork. I feel like such a bad influence because this is the first time I'm sitting down studying for this class's exam and the exam is at 9 a.m. tomorrow. So really great, really fun stuff. It's okay though because hopefully this motivates you if you haven't started studying sit down if you're watching my video get your schoolwork out we can study together it will be great i don't know if i mentioned this so i have an exam tomorrow at 9 a.m and then the next day i have another exam technically it's open all week which i just didn't realize and i didn't check it closes at 11:55, so it's like an assignment that i have to hand in and then i have one more exam next week which is for psych class so i got lucky i only have three exams I think that's one of the reasons why I was being so lenient on studying, which I definitely just should have started studying the second that I was done all my classes and I just didn't. You live and you learn just means I have to grind these classes to make sure I get a good mark and ace my exam. Moral of the story is do not wait last minute to study for your exams. <laughs> it's not a good idea. It never is. It's gonna montage me studying. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. <laughs> this pimple is just not gonna stop. It's just not gonna stop. Good morning, you guys. Um, as you can tell, yesterday I kind of quit studying. Um, I actually didn't even finish everything off my to-do list. I didn't, but yeah, I didn't vlog for the rest of the night. Back here vlogging today. My hair just looks really funny. I'm gonna fix this. Okay, I'm just gonna leave my hair like this. It looks absolutely disgusting. My extensions are so bad right now. I was supposed to get like a whole new set of extensions and dye my hair and everything, but I'm gonna have to wait because we went into lockdown, so... I have to wait till everything opens up again. It is 9.38. My exam opened at 9 a.m. and it closes at 12, so I'm gonna start at like 10, I think. I'm gonna start at 10 and do some review of my notes before I start. I was supposed to wake up at 6 a.m. and do my whole morning routine. However, I was so, so tired. I woke up at 4 a.m. and had a low blood sugar and that just drained me. So I ended up just waking up at like 8.39. It's been a week, guys. It's been a week. Anyways, I'm gonna do some review of my notes and then take my exam. And then I'm gonna have breakfast. I haven't even ate yet, but I have no appetite right now. Objection system. The best business deal you ever made. Thank you, Claire. It's 11:22. Turns out the exam, like I thought, I I thought I had till not, nine to twelve, two hours out of that time gap. But apparently it closes at 11:30, and I just got done. Oh, I'm like shaking. I'm so anxious. Finished my first exam. I'm so glad that class is over with. I'm praying to God that I pass that exam because honestly, some of those questions were so confusing, like the way it was worded. Okay. I'm going to go make breakfast, get ready, chill, and then I need to start my essay. Hi guys, so it's much later now. It's actually getting sunny out, which is great because it's been disgusting for basically like five days at least. But anyways, I got ready for the day. I think I'm just gonna wear this. I changed and I put leggings on. <laughs> the microphone audio might be bad. This is what I'm wearing. 
I, I low-key wore this, not to bed, but I put it on before I filmed, um, so it's clean. <laughs> I need to start my assignment, however, I realize I ran out of floss, so I'm going to see if I can run to Walmart, because I need floss and razor thingies, like ch the changing razor, I do you know what I'm talking about? Razor heads? I think that's the name of it. I'm going to see if I can run to Walmart and get that, and then I'm going to start on my assignment. I'm going to go to the store now, probably going to film on my iPhone if I can. All right, guys, I don't know if you hear the ads playing, but got the whip. Let's go. Um, yeah. Okay, so I just got done at Walmart. I'm in the parking lot right now. I completely forgot to vlog when I was in there. I literally went in to get floss. That is all. I just needed to get Bryce's floss. I came out with shampoo and conditioner and hair mask and toothpaste. Yeah, I was not expecting to spend that much. No joke, when I get home, I am budgeting because I get paid tomorrow and I just... I just can't spend my money anymore. I'm not gonna do it. I got a Walmart because I forgot to vlog in there. So I got shampoo and conditioner just because I used the last bit of it today when I showered. The Heritage by Mindy shampoo and conditioner. I watched their vlogs and Brooklyn and Bailey's vlogs, fun fact. So I wanted to try this out. I plan on getting Olaplex just because my hair is kind of damaged. Well, my extensions are damaged. I dye and straighten my hair a lot. So I need something that's gonna be strong on my hair, but I'm gonna wait to get that because it's kind of expensive. So I'm gonna wait till I actually dye my hair and get my new extensions. So the packaging is so cute and aesthetic. Can we just take a minute? Love that. Also got a hair mask because like I mentioned, my hair is so dry from straightening it all the time. So I wanted to try out her hair mask. So I got this. The next thing I got was, this is the, the floss that I came to get that I left with five things. So two braces floss. And then I also got this toothpaste. Just because my braces are staining so much, I think I'm going to stop getting clear braces and start getting blue because I'm over them staining so much. I had to get razor heads like I mentioned so I got these ones. I used the flamingo razor so I just got the little things that go with it. Now I'm going to safely skirt uh, to shoppers before I go home. That is my little Walmart haul. Time to go en route. I'll see you at shoppers. Can you tell it's windy? <laughs> um, okay, so I actually ended up, you saw the clip I got in Choppers. I don't even know if it's a good clip. It's probably like two seconds long. I ended up deciding I'm gonna save my money and I'm not gonna spend $12 on a primer that I probably don't need. So I'm just gonna wait it out. Yeah, I'll get it eventually, but I don't need it right now. I decided I spent too much money at Walmart, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get it. And I'm gonna go home now and budget my money. Maybe I'll film that. If you guys do want to see like a budgeting little segment in another video, I can do that, but I don't know. I don't know how that would work. Um, yeah, anyways, I'm gonna go home, budget, and then start my assignment. Anyways, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Maybe I'll wait for this guy to pull up, okay. I am gonna be safe and not vlog when I drive because I do not have a tripod to vlog. So see you at home. Hey guys, okay, I am home now. I am currently actually watching Mindy's stories. This is the YouTuber I'm talking about who made this line. Um, I've been watching them for years, like I mentioned. I kind of bought these without seeing how they work, but I knew it was good. Like I've seen some stories before. I'm just looking at the Instagram account of this brand and seeing like, seeing how everything works and all the other products they have, because low-key, I kind of want to get some more of their products. They have like argan oil and this little scalp wash which is really cool so i'm just kind of learning about that <laughs> seeing what i just bought and then i want to tidy up my room budget and do some work so you will probably see a montage next yeah that's the plan and then i'm gonna have dinner but it's so sunny out guys i'm so happy the sun literally gives me serotonin it's amazing i have good vibes i feel good i don't even feel anxious so yeah it's gonna be good it's gonna be good it's gonna be good let's get down to business about this class that I'm studying for is that I have to watch the movies in order to do the exams and the assignments 
And so <laughs> I have to go watch the movie now to do this assignment. <laughs> anything i washed this sweater yesterday that's why i'm wearing it again i feel like i've worn the sweater this whole video I'm not gonna wear it today it's just really comfortable to sleep in hello guys good morning happy saturday so obviously i did not vlog yesterday i spent basically the whole day just doing my essay and then i submitted it done with that class but that took so long so finally done with that class i have one more exam and I'm going to take the vlog into today because I didn't vlog yesterday and so I'm going to study a bit for that exam. It's not till Friday so I have a week to prepare for it. Alliterate the fact that this pimple still has not healed. I don't know what's going on. My skin is just not it. With that being said, I'm going to take a little bit of self-care this morning to do a face mask, do a hair mask, clean my room, kind of just reset. And so stressed. So my breakfast but I had a pancake. I feel like I've been really bad at vlogging in the mornings, so I need to be better at that for my next vlog. Okay, so I'm going to dampen my hair first. It says that you can use it overnight, which I kind of wish I did that because then my hair would be super soft, but there's always next time. look like this on the internet but anyways i'm gonna clean my room now and just do my weekly little cleaning declutter whatever you know the vibes and watch youtube at the same time because i love doing that still it is i'm gonna be honest it's six o'clock p.m 6 30 actually almost seven what is the exact time 6 45 i'm not i'm still thrown off by the daylight savings it's been it's literally almost may but still i get surprised when it's 7 p.m and light out so i've had a very slow day and on purpose actually i've just been taking it super easy today because this week has been chaotic i've mentioned this you already know I haven't really done anything today if I'm being honest, did not study yet. Um, yeah, didn't even edit. Like, I haven't done anything productive at all. percent okay with it. I'm accepting it. So I think I'm gonna get dressed and then I'm going to... I'm gonna do a little bit of studying just because I do wanna kind of just take it easy today. Okay, so this is what I decided on. I'm wearing a Gymshark sports bra and Lululemon leggings because I was not trying to put on jeans today don't have enough loungewear. I feel like I wear the same like couple of sweaters and the same couple of sweatpants all the time and I just feel like I don't have enough loungewear. I'm definitely going to be purchasing more loungewear so if you have any recommendations of places please let me know in the comments. I have a closet full of sweaters that I just haven't worn. It's not even that I don't like them it's just that I have not worn them. The story is I'm gonna start actually wearing the hoodies that I have not touched in months. Okay so I am going to do some budgeting right now because I just got paid so I'm gonna budget move some money around pay some bills adult stuff really fun and then i'm going to start doing a little bit of studying and after that i'm going to work on my notion i recently downloaded notion or whatever <laughs> If you do your taxes, you know this feeling, but I checked my bank account and I was so confused because I was like, where did this bit of money come from? And I realized I just did my taxes like two weeks ago, I think, and I got money back. And I didn't think I was gonna get money back. And I got money back? Wow, 
Love that. Love, love, love that. Also, I don't know if you guys believe in the law of attraction. I 100% believe it. I practice it. And I've been seeing like angel numbers two times, 33 and 111. And I always see 11 or 111. And those both meant like manifesting like what you want, like you're manifesting whatever. And I have a couple of things that I'm trying to manifest. And it's just crazy because things are really aligning up and I'm just, wow, it's crazy. But I'd share that, so if there's something you're manifesting, keep working to it. I'm doing a little bit of studying for psych just a little bit because I do want to give myself a break like I mentioned but I am going to end the vlog here so I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my exam week in my life please wish me luck on my psych exam but hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing me study for exams and all the other things that I did in this vlog let me know what video you want to see next I love you so much and I will see you all in my next video bye guys